Welcome everyone to another episode of the Cambridge United FIFA 23 career mode. And as you can tell from the title, unfortunately, something not so great does happen in today's episode. However, that is not until the end, so we can ignore that and focus on the transfer news of Lloyd Jones joining German side FC Nuremberg for 870k, with Ibsman Rossi and Okadina pretty much being our only center backs that I'm actually going to play for us going to be selling Lloyd-Jones, get a good chunk of money for doing that, and have also sold Joe Ironside, starting best striker overall-wise on the roster, but how good Oaken b has been playing for us recently, decided to get rid of Ironside to get, I mean, 940k transfer, it's almost a million, that's a very good deal in my opinion, and now it's time for the Papa John's Trophy game against Forest Green Rovers. And this is how the team will be lining up. Mitov is going to be the goalkeeper. Okadina, Ibsen, Rossi, center backs. Williams, Hanstrop, outside backs. O'Neill and May are the center mids. Tracy, Brophy on the wings. Nibs, attacking mid. And Okin and B-Ray up top. Here are the highlights. Might be onto something with that ball. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. going well oh what an opportunity and this was at home and second time around he... that's very effective good high pressing pressing high to win the ball Adam May well that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball a very good tackle. Now showing excellent vision. Now the task is to remain focused. And a goal! Electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Just wanted to get it out of there. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And he's in. Big chance it is. And the cross... And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. Can they make it 3-0? A goal! Calmly position. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Ten minutes left for play. And attempting the through ball. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit... Connor Wickham. <laughs> Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Oh, so we would go on to win this game 3-2. However, Forrest Green, we're truly making it a game at the end there, scoring in the 82nd and 90th minute, but did not matter thanks to a goal from Tracy and two from Okunabure. I mean, pretty pretty even game. Dribbling-wise, they had a 95% dribble success rate. We only had 83. But we had 89 shot accuracy. They only had 75. So that's truly where we made up for everything. And bad news, Okunabure dislocated his shoulder in that game. He's out for two months. So Ironside might get some playing time. Smith might get some playing time. I don't know what we're going to do, but it's not going to be Okina B. Ray. And now we're traveling to Bolton in a league fixture. Lineup is the same except for Smith. I've decided to go with as our starting striker in the absence of Okina B. Ray. Here are the highlights. Now 
The high press was very much on. Body on the line. Sheehan. Musa Juwara. Now, who can he play it to? He's in behind. And a touch of finesse. There it is. And he could... George Williams. Nibs. Strong but fair tackle. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Can he put it away? It has to be, surely. And a goal! Williams. Shiloh Tracy. And a textbook interception. Bakayoko. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Will it be? Must be. Oh, so we lost. For the first time. A tough, tough loss. Three to zero. We had less than one expected goal. But we'd had 44 tackles because we were pretty much playing defense the entire time because we just kept giving the ball to them. Only 25% shot accuracy. It was just not meant to be our game. And we've dropped now closer to relegation than promotion. So next month, FA Cup game against Port Vale, I think. Or no, that might still be the Papa John's Trophy. So, player play that game, and at least one of the other league fixtures. But yeah, that, that loss was a uh, tough loss because hadn't really. I mean, we all the games have been close, or we get a blowout. But for us to truly lose, like lose, lose the game, was not really what I thought was going to happen. So, just gonna have to go back to the drawing board, maybe. See how these games go. Maybe have to reevaluate our tactics. And hopefully from that point on, we can just keep on winning. Keep on progressing well. If you guys want to see more FIFA content, check out the links below in the description. And I'll see you all in the next video.